What's up guys? What's up guys? Frebs here and today we're doing the last cup and finishing off the series. The Bell Cup or the Super Bell Cup. We're going to be Gold Mario in the Gold Cart with Gold Wheels. I don't have the Gold Hang Glider yet. So we'll just stick with this one for now. And it is the Bell Cup. It's So... Yeah, we'll get the set of races done, and then that's it for this series. I'm, I'm happy they brought uh, Neo Bowser City back. It's a good stage. Now, what would really be nice if they brought back some of like the Woohoo Loop and Maka Woohoo Maka courses. Those are very cool and fun. What do you have? A coin and a green shell. Is that Rosalina? Or, okay, that's Rosalina. I thought that was pink gold. Oh my god, nice. I'll give her props. That, that was a nice green shell bounce off the wall thing. How did I? Oh, okay. He, they're rotating around him. Not doing too hot right now. Okay, I'm. Can you still do this? No, you can't. There's a border. You used to be able to swoop right through there and land right here in Mario Kart 7, but you can't do that anymore. I. L in. Oh my God. At least in every video, I've gotten hit by a random green shell. It's just like destined. It's just the green shell and frubs. They go together perfectly. That's a nice car cart combo. You know what would be cool but honestly kinda stupid if Nintendo made these characters? If they made you know how like they made um come on, go up. You know how they made like Dry Bowser and Dry Bones, which is basically Bowser with his skin stripped off and the Koopas with their skin stripped off? What if they made all the Koopalings with their skin stripped off? That would be low-key kinda cool, but just really stupid for character designs and extra characters. But, you know, there's always the thought. I am doing really bad. So I think what I'm going to do, depending on how the game works, we got Animal Crossing New Horizons for Christmas. So I think, I don't, I really don't know how the game works. So I might put it, I'll probably record it, and then depending on like how the game works and stuff, because I know there's like no end to it, so like pro maybe after like 10, 20 episodes, and I make my island look good. So, yeah. We'll uh, see if videos of that comes out. I'm planning on doing Rocket League. Hopefully, hopefully. I, I can't even talk anymore. Hopefully Fall Guys. Fall Guys is always fun. If I get um, 3D All-Stars as a digital code, then I'll, I'll definitely do 3D All-Stars. I've always wanted to play 64 in Sunshine. And then every time I played Galaxy, I would get to the end. But my little siblings would end up deleting my data. So I've never completed Galaxy either. But Galaxy's a fun game. Definitely recommend it. Definitely like hard and strategic, but very fun game. I've heard that 64 is quite a good game, so I'm really excited for 64. And I heard that Sunshine isn't the best game, but it's still really fun. What I like is that they have all the 3D Mario games, except for... No, because they're bringing that too. So they have all the 3D games except for Super Mario Galaxy 2 on the Switch. Because they have Super Mario 64, the first 3D Mario game. Super Mario Sunshine, the second one. Then they have Galaxy, the third one. They did not bring Galaxy 2. They are not bringing Super Mario 3D Land, but they are bringing Super Mario 3D World, 
with Bowser's Fury, which I don't know what Bowser's Fury is, Fury, but it seems cool. So. So, of the date that I'm recording it, it is not yet Christmas, it is <laughs> Christmas Eve of the, it's Christmas Eve Eve, so the 23rd. So, I already know we have Animal Crossing, but, New Horizons, but if we get All-Stars or Home Circuit, I definitely will be trying those out, because they are both cool games. So yeah, just a little, ooh. I think you guys will also like my Fall Guys video that comes out tomorrow. Should be the 29th, because what? This comes out on the 28th, or it should. Yeah. Thanks, Pink Old Peach. Oh my god, this give this. Oh my god. I hate this one. Like, I like the course, but it, like, it's like a butt clencher type course, because you have to. Oh my god. I told you, there, there's a, every, every cup get randomly shot by a green shell. But it's a butt clincher because you're doing a drift in between a wall and a train, and if you hit the wall, then it breaks your drift, and if you hit the train, then you're just gonna do the weird Mario foot thing. Ooh, ooh, that was a nice dodge of the fire flower. Like, th that is a tiny space, and the wall went a little bit further back, but it's a tiny space. Especially for 200cc and drifting. Okay, we're just gonna cut through this. How, is that triple red shells? How in the world do you triple red shells in second? It might have been triple green shells, but still. Like, you're in between the rocks which are gonna slow you down and the train which is just gonna make you do the Mario flip thing. How did I, okay. Oh my god, everybody got hit by the train. The train is just bulldozing everyone. And I'm getting bulldozed by items. And I can't drift right now. Oh, I think this is gonna be the lowest position I've been, position I've been in the whole series. Go. Oh, are you joking me? Go, go, go. I don't know why Yoshi did not use his mushrooms, but I somehow pulled off six. One last race, and that's Big Blue, and Big Blue is really fun. I enjoy Big Blue. I like doing the shortcuts with the, not anti-gravity, but low gravity. I just really wish they made, uh, like, the starting line, since this is, like, one long race. I really wish they made the starting line a boost panel like they do in Mute City and all the other lap counts in this race. That would be fun. I wonder if there's actually a, a race in F-Zero called Big Blue and Mute City. There probably is, and they're probably just exact recreations. Which is really cool. Shortcut. Can I do this? Oh, okay, no. Worth a try. Would be cool if you could. Can I hit that? No, I cannot. I don't even know where that went. Probably went down. I figured it would keep going straight since we're going straight, but I guess not. This is probably my favorite part of the course, when you take that turn while oh, you're flipped upside down because you can see the water. I took the wrong track. And I took the... Oh, wait, maybe not. Can I... Yeah, there we go. And then do this. Way too far. Holy cow. Oh, my God. At some point, they just give up. You saw I just dropped. And now I'm getting bullied by items. Yep. This is the... 
Don't hit me. Come on, let me get fifth. Thank you. Fourth. Okay, so the last two races weren't as exciting as I thought, but that last shortcut that I took, if you take it at more of an angle, you can make it. So, yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And that's it for the Mario Kart series, so let me know if you liked it or not. And I might do it again with 50cc, because 50cc is slow. So, yeah, see you guys next time. Bye!